I started sculpting when I was still working with clay. And what I was doing was making maybe about this high, maybe about three foot high of these cylinder figures with sculptured tops out of clay. And I would send them to an exhibit. And um, the problem was in clay and transportation, they would be broken. So I realized if I was going to continue in that direction, I had to weld. And so I made the shift from working with clay, which I liked very much, into working with metal. At various times, I had little um, bumps of being sick from grinding metal dust. The biggest problem that I had over the years was because I was doing arc welding. In the summertime, when I was working on one particular project, and it was just on and on, endless welding, and it was so hot because the metal's getting hot, you're getting hot, I wore a shirt that wasn't leather. It, I, had, I had cloth over me, but it did not keep that sunlight out. And so as a result, it was right here, I got about a, a more than a quarter size. Fortunately, it was not malignant. My body had just thrown all those cells into one place and just kept it right there. The transition from leaving welding into what I first went into was painting, but it was a difficult thing. And, and I continued to try to get large scale commissions even after I knew I shouldn't be welding anymore. I liked some of the results and people liked the results of the painting, but it didn't give me the satisfaction that the large scale sculpture had given me. Uh, now that I'm writing, I find that writing is easier than anything and it just ticks right along. The, the idea of the scale that I've lost is now made up for by the fact that I'm trying in my writing to preserve something. If I don't get it down, it'll be lost. It won't exist. Today we have a comfortable, happy world to live with the other except we haven't really ascended into li living beyond the scope of our time and our place. So I think that's, that's the most important thing, to tell people, you know, you think this life is over. Don't live it for this life. Live it for eternity.